you asked about the qualities of a real guru, the question must be turned inwards. One can never really know the qualities of a guru, for there are no fixed qualities. Far more important is to ask the qualities of a real disciple. If one is a real disciple, one meets only the real. If the disciplehood is pure within, then one does not stay for long with a false guru. So what then is real disciplehood? Paying complete attention and in that complete attention there is neither acceptance nor rejection. You are just with what the person, the Guru informed the person is saying, you are just with that. without passing a judgment on it, without rejecting it, without even taking it as the truth. When in spite of your so-called indifference towards acceptance and rejection, The words of that person, if they still penetrate your heart, then you know that he is the right one. So, it is a tricky business trying to figure out the qualities of a Guru because the Guru can show himself or herself in a thousand ways at different points in different situations. Sometimes talking a lot about peace, sometimes talking a lot about conflict as well, sometimes even prodding you to go to war. Now if we have certain benchmarks regarding the conduct and the ways of the Guru, then we will be confused. Because the Guru will not conform to or abide by our standards. So far better is to have an inner compass regarding one's own position as a listener. And when you are really listening sharply, then the false receives only two treatments. Either it falls, either it drops, the false would drop, or you would be able to see the truth even in the false. Both of these are good for you. So a person might be sitting in front of you and saying something which is not of much worth. It happens. You would either be able to casually just ignore it or you would be able to go to the root of it and see truth even in the falls. But none of that has anything or much to do with the Guru. That has a lot to do with your own awakened sense of knowing. So turn the question inwards. How can I be an awakened disciple? When you are an awakened disciple, you meet only the awakened Guru. It's always a perfect match. 
when you are not awakened then you keep meeting you know random people yeah and even if an awakened one comes to you you are not fully sensitive yeah. to them you may have an awakened one talking to you but you not be fully getting the import of his message so it's not so much about the other person the guru or, or the book or the author it's not about so much about them it's much more to do with person bring me to another question actually I'm still not sure exactly what the meaning is but uh, I think I can absorb a lot of what you're saying but uh, sometimes it gets me thinking and I've always been taught uh, and also I've had experience with whenever I start thinking more Sometimes it's it's good you get more knowledge and things but at the same time if you always think in thinking thinking you just get yourself into this uh, useless world of thinking yeah how can you cut that out but still read uh read all these books and absorb the knowledge without getting putting my own in the moment of listening to begin with in the moment of listening listen that will cut out the thinking later on if you feel like thinking you may keep thinking but a point will come when even later on you will be so alert to the happenings that there will be little space left for thinking but to begin with at least in the moment of listening listen so fully that there is no need for thinking and if thought still arises let it arise don't fight it don't fight it and then another problem i have is when i listen i, I think i'm a decent listener i can listen but uh then i can't recall half the stuff when i listen to ten minutes come again I, i i think i can listen fairly well but 10 minutes later i forget most of what i was uh, listening is not about memorizing so even if it bypasses the memory don't do it if you feel really present to that it may go to memory it may not go to memory it would have still done its work chances are if you have really listened a lot of it won't go to the memory after the session if somebody asks you what did he say what was the speaker saying you will not be able to tell much <laughs> yeah that's you okay